They've got a couple of teams sweating on them in the run home. It's North Melbourne and Sydney as Pride Round continues at North Hobart. There is Garner. Dumped to the de deck, umpire said. Dangerous tackle against Giselle Davies and a free kick to the star, Jazzy Garner, to get things moving for North. She puts them inside 50 for the first time. Couple options underneath this one. Awkward landing for Shearlaw. It almost came back to her. Bruton lurking. Sockers it forward, keeps it moving. McAvoy needs to be clean. Handball to no one in particular. Sergeant Wilson laid the tackle on Bruton. Kennedy, can she get the hands free? Umpire said play on, knocked out in the tackle. Eddie in there working hard as always for North. Garner, Mia King, knocked off the kick by Hurley. Dangerous spot, spoil from McAvoy. Gather from Bruton towards the pocket. Garner involved again from the angle. Brings it back cleverly, finds Shearlaw. Kate Shearlaw, you can see the strapping on the elbow. She's back from that injury and she's picked up where she left off. She's having a great year, missed the last couple of weeks with that elbow injury. Here is Sophia Hurley starting in the middle of the ground. Had it stripped, knocked away by Emma King. Here's Mia King hunting the football. Uses Bresnahan. Awkward bounce, nutmeg King. Picked up by Hurley, beautiful delivery. And there's Montana Ham. The young gun, 40 out. Great response from Sydney. get to the ball and then get it into their forward line. So center clearance is going to be critical and that's a block against Giselle Davies because she prevented Rennie getting a run at the ball and then didn't touch it before it hit the ground. So Rennie, Bresnahan sweeps off the back of the square, delivers it inside 50. Sheila got to a good position. Sullivan, oh, wrapped down in a tackle. How does the umpire read that? Says play on. Sullivan, or Sullivan rather, down behind play. Martin, Garner. North have got another. Great pressure by the Swans there. Probably a little bit unlucky not to get a free kick there with Jazzy dropping the ball there. How do they read this? It's going to be a free kick to Lexi Hamilton. Lent back cleverly on Rennie to level things up again. She strokes it through. Hamilton. Comes across, takes the space from Rennie, wins the tap. Got it forward, only as far as Kennedy. Hamilton again under pressure from Tripodi. She now goes hunting it on the ground. Garner, Hurley, gets the kick forward. Two on one in favour of North Melbourne. O'Shea looks to accelerate away from Berylson, which is not an easy thing to do, but she did it really well. To a two on two down the line. Wall tries to get to the back on O'Sullivan. Strength from Vicky Wall. Off to Shearlaw. Pops a handball. A little bit too much for Bruton. Awkward bounce. O'Loughlin can tidy it up and North responds. <laughs> Hamilton worked Rennie really underneath it. Ball spills. Bullis. Hamilton threw a boot at it and kicks another. Three goals apiece. O'Loughlin over the top. King and Bruton there for the Kangas. King gets to it. Gets it to O'Loughlin. They did really well in very little space to continually move it forward. Good crunching effort from Randall came through. Laid some body on body. And there's a sore, very sore Swans player. Is it O'Sullivan again? It is. That was a tough, tough contest. Yeah, Julie big, O'Sullivan's already worn a couple today. Yeah, big collision there. And then very brave for O'Sullivan to go back with the fly. It's always... um. A hard position to be in as a player because you don't really know what's coming. But yeah, cleaned up by our own player there. That's looks sore. Under two minutes in the opening term. It's been an entertaining quarter. Mitchell slapped it away. Coming through with Smith. Mia King wrapped up by Hurley. Finds her boot. Finds Bruton. Bruton goes goalward. Good body work from Shearlaw and Eddie was clipped high. Well done by the Kangaroos. Oh. Sydney would be, yeah, not, not too happy about that one, I don't reckon, Jace. Just before and the 50. quarter break. Oh, there we go. But just before the quarter break, you, you don't really want to give any team any, like, sort of loose goals towards the end. And um, I think Bella Eddie's going to put this one away here. So. She's having an excellent season. Kicks her seventh and North are back in front. She was pretty close to goal anyway, but it just gave her the opportunity to really slot it and put it away. Beautiful tap down to Garner. North get another clearance, looking dangerous late. Here's O'Loughlin. O'Loughlin will give them another opportunity inside 50. High kick. 
Over the back of Randall. Sheila leaves it for Talia, who gathers, can she? And does. North go bang, bang. So North have edged out to 14 points. Swans have been good, but they're still in dangerous territory here. And North looking to really press home that advantage and build a lead. Hurley taken down by Eddie. Handball cut off by Gat. Pokes it forward. Danger here. Garner tracks it inside 50. Jazzy gathers and will set it up beautifully. And Sheila will let it bounce through. Jazzy gets her second. There's Julia Sullivan. She's been in enormous pain. We've seen even when she was doing those tests, you could see the discomfort all over her face. So no surprise that she's unfortunately done for the day. They can set up now and hopefully keep it in their front half. Lurking is Tripodi. King in there as well. Ruby goes to ground. Wall tries to muscle her way through. They've got it as far as the goal square, but Sergeant Wilson and Hurley in there to prevent it going any further. Dangerous territory here for Sydney. They really need to just lock on here and desperate defending. Great work from Randall. Half a chance. Another goal. Mitchell down the line, they need a bounce, and they get one. McCarthy, inside 50, need a contest. Well done, Birch took front spot against Privatelli. And then the kick was perfect. Tripodi, straight up the middle. Riddell, here go the Kangas with numbers four to the football. Sheila looks up, look at the numbers streaming inside, and again they punish on the counter. Bruton over the top, North cracked them open. O'Loughlin with the greatest of ease. 70 seconds to play in the third. King did the work early on Tarrant, who goes to ground. Randall crashes in. Mitchell, Steen, pressure from Bruton. High kick from Lisa Steen. O'Shea and McCarthy there. Martin somehow through traffic. Oh, well done, Neve Martin. Brilliant goal. They need a mark now. Seconds ticking down and they'll get it. And Garner will kick after the siren and just. Jazz Garner with her 20th touch. And that'll be 50. And North will get their fourth for the quarter. And the Kangas keep on rolling. Garner kicks her third. Hurley, pressured by King. He's Mia King. Gets it to Gat. Handball forward, chance for Bruton. King, the overlap, draws a crowd, pumps a handball to Eddie. Kick inside 50 was touched off the boot. Hamilton and Wall collide, flipped out. Taken by Martin, off the left boot. Oh, that's a magnificent finish. Neve gets a second. North undefeated, but needed to win today to stay on top. Tarrant, slung in the tackle. Put it to a dangerous spot. Vicky Wall on a her left boot, and she hammers through North's 12th. Incredible how North Melbourne at times feel like they've got two or three extra players on the ground just by having them in predictable positions. Gat steps the player on the mark, gains some territory inside 50 to King, and Emma flies over the top for a strong grab. I think for Sydney, it's just important to keep showing positive signs and pro progress in this last quarter. Emma King. Has not missed all season. She's got five straight. Kennedy receives from Davies. Pokes it towards half forward. Awkward one for Bullis. Against O'Shea. Davies comes in. Gives away the free kick for a high shot. Erica clutching that right knee. The knee area. Here's another look. Tangle of legs. Oh, that's an awkward one, isn't it? With Davies' body coming right down on top of... Erica O'Shea, and you can see she can't put any weight on that right leg. Wall crashes through. Smith taken down. Riddell keeps it moving. Eddie tries to do likewise. Mia King, they create the opportunity over the top. O'Loughlin is pushed in the back and will get a free kick. Well, they hunt in numbers in their forward line. As soon as the ball hits deck, you've got, they've got smalls there, Alice being one of them, and she slots this one. She's kicked her third. Haven't been able to find one since the opening term. Had so many 
inside 50s. Maybe here, Hamilton bounces it goalward, and they get the goal they've been working so hard for. McCarthy with the final kick of the day. No score. And North Melbourne get the job done in Hobart. And they move a step closer to a top two finish.